Hello, wonderful world is the internet. As you can tell, I am putting on a very, very terrible version of a Slavic accent. But basically, I've just made up a mixture of everything, really. Basically, what I've done is. Um, no. Oh. Well, guys, no, good. So, guys, um, you know what, um. Well, let's just say I've made two small Usha liners from two very different eras. One of them was an actual tutorial I found on Rich LaRusso's channel. The other one I just made off the top of my head. We are first going to make the one off the top of my head. Well, we're going to check it out. Uh, I am not because it was a L on Earth to build. So yeah. Uh. Um. Let's see. A clear. Yeah, that's gonna save up a bunch of stuff. And um, come on. There we go. Deliet. 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 Delete it. So good. Now we are good video quality, or I hope we are. So um, uh, that that that's good. That's very good. So guys, this fix. Uh, I'm sorry if I keep hopping from low battery charge soon to hey video quality terrible you need to fix it so yeah I'm sorry if it keeps doing that but um does it look like I give a sham about it no I do not but anyways the first thing that I did I built this small little diner room, basically, with two actually working elevators that you can really use. Yeah. So let me just show you how they work, okay? So in here, you step in, then boom, boom, boom. Boom. And then boom. See? Yep. Then you get to be on the top deck. Then when you want to end up is going back down. Just do that, okay? So there's the first thing done. Oh, and you can see that it goes the portal out in the distance.
This is a cute little restaurant I built up at the very top. So, yeah. Oh, dude, I need to do this fast. Like, straight up Sonic speeds. Nope. Ah! Alright, y'all can hear birds. Um, I used to make this a floating zoo, but then I killed most of the animals. PETA, please don't sue me. I, I, I don't need to be sued again. So, um. Yep. Instead of actually making a slanted funnel, this is what I did. If you want to see a tutorial for how to do that properly, you can. I'm not at all going to stop you. You just have to end up saying so. So, I made just lifeboats with red bottoms. I used the nether... Uh, I used the nether wart block for, for them. My, my bad. So, that's basically it. I just go down to the very bottom of the sea. No, no, come on. I know there's a place to get this there, I just don't know where. Okay, um, flip it. See? there so okay yeah basically I made this very crammed but like it, it's still functional see in here small lamp that you can turn on and their bed see it's basically how it did the, that Ugh. I'm losing my mind oh no basically built this big pool Build a shower, which by the way can actually work. Uh, did that for the shower drain. It could do that whenever you have to pump out bilge grease and funk. And here is not the boiler room, but just two large kitchen rooms, I guess you could say. They basically act as the kitchen to get in and out all the food. So, yeah. Bunch of foods that, that can come in and out of there, okay? So, I'm recording for eight minutes straight by now. Let's go to the much better ship, in my opinion. Okay, and yeah, I think I might blow this up soon. If y'all want a tutorial on this, I'm gonna have to deconstruct every single block and then rebuild it. Oh, oh yeah. I also made it a tri screw. Basically, with four little propeller blades on each of them. I know that one looks a bit out of scale to those, but, or looks much larger, but trust me, it should be the exact same scale. Only thing is, is that that one is basically like that. Only thing is, it does put diagonally, so therefore I should not get any hate on this. And I know some of are going to be asking about on this one. Yeah, I made a double screw that only has three propeller blades. And yes, yes, they might look inappropriate. They might look like private part pixel art. And that was a very disturbing rhyme. But 
Just to let you know, I didn't want this to end up being a quad screw. Or, well, no, not a quad screw, but a quad bladed ship since I don't really think it's large enough to have those. Even though this one is like 70 blocks longer than that one. Yeah. And so basically, I added. Four of these, and I added a bunch of chairs back here. I actually added a skylight, and mind you, all of these ideas, with the exception of those, those are all completely mine. Is actually the guy that did the um, was the small ocean liner. RMS Lake Erie and Lake Michigan tutorials. Or, no, not tutorials, but just look around, I guess you could say. I use the same design of. No. I use the same design of funnel for this one. Only exception is that it's one block shorter. And no, not by like tall. I mean by length. So that one over there is five. This one should be three. I mean, no, four. My goodness. I'm having more strokes than Charmix. Yeah, I am broken. See, if y'all haven't seen his little tutorial for this, I recommend you go do so because it is a good little boat. Like, heck, you can name it like the Tugboat 2.0 or something. Whatever you want, really. So, in here, empty, haven't done anything yet. Might make part of that the smoke room. Just because I want this to be a very luxurious ship. And, I'm gonna give y'all a tiny quiz. What are these trap doors for? A. Toilets. B. Elevators. C. Piles of crap on the ground. And I mean... The... So, yes. If you picked B, then you are correct. Oh, and of course that's the wrong elevator. Okay. No, oh, down. This is the first room. Well, not the first room I built, actually. This is the, the second to last room that I built. Uh oh. Um. We'll just pretend that never happened, guys. Just had absolute brain to put. This is actually a small kitchen with little windows, um, a seating room where you can eat and stuff like that. This is a little just sitting room slash library, really. There's some fancy art made by the, the one and truly Squidward Tentacles. No, of course not. His art is looking terrible. Oh, all of these are literally third class cabins. Like, I need to show y'all. Third class cabins. Yeah. And I actually built this while listening to RMS. Well, no, no, HMHS Britannic Sinks Real Time Documentary with courtesy of Titanic Honor and Glory. So, okay, I'm gonna have to make this a Sonic round. Straight up, no, straight up speed run of this boy. And here is the dance room. See, up here is the salon. Part one, basically, part one meaning it's the first layer, 
gonna have to make this a two-part special. Bye, guys. See you later.